now, here's meteorologist T.J. Del Santo with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Plenty of blue skies right now, but looking down the road, we are looking at some big temperature changes, but let's talk about the positive things, and that's the weather for today. Beautiful sunshine, and the Red Sox are going to the World Series. An even more positive thing to talk about. Looking at sunshine as we look on off to the west from downtown Providence. Beautiful way to start the day. Temperature right now up to 50 in Smithfield, 53 in Taunton, 54 in New Bedford, 53 in Newport, and down in Westerly at 52. Our live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar scanning Newport right now. All is quiet down there. URI, their quad cam. You see we've got a few clouds in the sky there. 54 degrees down there in Kingston, Rhode Island, Newport Harbor. We've got a few clouds there in the distance. Maybe you can make out a big old ship on the right hand side of your screen. Kind of dock like a cruise ship down there in Newport Harbor. We are looking at a nice day down there in the city by the sea. Emerald Bay Retirement Living 51 degrees. They've got a wind tending from the west at two miles an hour. All the clouds and showers have moved offshore. Cold front working its way offshore as well and behind it dry air will work its way into southern New England. Let's pick things up now with our future cast and starting you off at three o'clock this afternoon and take note we've got dry air in place clear skies plenty of sunshine Quiet through this evening, quiet into tomorrow morning. We're going to stop right there at 8 o'clock, and we're looking at uh, sunshine at that time. Morning commute tomorrow, back to school at the bus stops looks to be just fine. Tomorrow evening looks to be dry as well, so nice tomorrow. Now on Tuesday, we would begin to see some changes. Probably not in the morning, although some extra clouds, certainly a possibility on Tuesday morning. And then by Tuesday afternoon, lots of clouds, maybe a spot shower, but we'll see a better chance of showers later in the night as a cold front works its way through the uh, northeast and behind that front, much cooler air will work its way into southern New England. And notice that little blob of clouds and showers offshore. That's a developing coastal storm, which will be mixing with that cooler air. Possible some of the higher elevations uh, well inland could see a little bit of snow uh, later in the week, but uh, here in southeastern New England, just looking at a chilly rain during the middle part of the week. I'll show you that in more detail in just a second What for today. 63 in the east side, 64 Pawtucket, 63 degrees in downtown Providence. Over there in Riverside at the Carousel, the first annual Great Townie Pumpkin Contest. I'll be one of the judges there about an hour or so. Looks good there with sunshine. 64 in Warwick and Cranston. Barrington 64 along the south coast in the mid 60s. Loads of sunshine. Beautiful day. Winds tending from the west. Gusting up to 25 though. Small craft advisory out there. Boaters through the afternoon. Up in northern Rhode Island. High should be topping out around 64 in Woonsocket. North Smithfield and Situate and Johnston. Good apple picking weather over in southeastern Mass. Sunshine. 64 in New Bedford, 63 in Fall River, a little Compton about 64 with a wind tending from the west about 5 to 15 miles an hour. Not to be forgotten, the Patriots are playing over there in uh, New Jersey, 63 degrees. They play the Jets, sunny, breezy and cool over in New Jersey this afternoon around 1 o'clock. jack o -Lantern spectacular, looking at chilly temperatures in the 50s, but it will be dry. Seven day future cast, quiet next couple of days, late shower on Tuesday. Now on Wednesday, that's when the coastal storm could affect us and possibly affect uh, game one of the World Series as they take on the Cardinals. We're looking at temperatures in the 40s throughout the game with a chilly rain. Thursday, though, we dry out. Same for Friday and Saturday. Notice those temperatures only in the low 50s in the afternoon late in the week. And you can always get your updated future cast by going to our website at WPRI.